In this video, you'll see how to upload multiple files using Blackboard's content collection. Once you're in your course in Blackboard, go to Content Collection. Click on Content Collection, and the first item that appears is your course ID. So we'll click on that. Here are some files that have already been loaded into my content collection. If I want to upload more, right here where it says Upload, I'll click on Upload Files. Uploading multiple files requires Java, so you might get a message asking for permission to use Java. So I'm going to choose Allow. And you can see at the top of the screen, I can load up a single file or I can load up multiple files. So multiple files is selected, and I can drag and drop the files in here, or I can use the Browse button. So I'll click on Browse, and I'll search for my documents just like you would any other attachment. So let's say this is the document that I want to upload to Blackboard. And if there are other files that I want to load that are listed right underneath it, I can hold down the Shift key and click the last file. And it will select all of the files in a row. But what if you have files that aren't listed one under the other? You can use the Control key on your keyboard. After you click first on the first file, hold down the Control key, click on the next file, and any other files that you want to upload and then click the Open button. You'll get a message that shows you the names of the files that it's about to upload. And then I'll just click on the Submit button. When the upload is complete, I get a message. And if I scroll down, I should be able to see the names of my files listed here in my content collection. So now how do I get that file into Blackboard for my students to be able to see? Let's say we're going to load it into Course Documents. I'll click on Course Documents, and then I'll choose Build Content, and I'll choose Item. Now I'll give this a name, and inside of the text box, I'll click on the Insert File icon that looks like a paperclip. And now the Insert Content link window pops up, and instead of clicking Browse My Computer, I'll click Browse Content Collection. And all of those files that I had uploaded appear. To have one of them load into Blackboard, first I have to click on the box to the left of the name of the file to select it, and then I'll click on Submit. And a new confirmation window appears, so we'll click Submit again. And one more time, click Submit. And now the link appears in the text section of my box. So I'll click Submit. And here's the article for students to see. All they need to do is click on the name of the article, and it will load on their computer. And that's how to upload multiple files to the content collection in Blackboard. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact us at the Office of Academic Technology.